If you're a Windows user who recently upgraded to the latest version of this OS, you might be glad to find that Windows 10 has its own little screen recording tool that you can use to record games and screen activity. The word might in this sentence is used for a reason, so let's see what this tool can do and can it replace some of the accomplished screen recording and game recording programs. First off, it's important to say that the screen recording tool that comes with Windows 10 is not a standalone program, but an extra feature that comes along with the Xbox app. Even though it's mainly intended for gameplay recording, you can use it the same way to record apps in Windows. Recording with it really can't be more simple. First you need to open your Xbox app and keep it running in the background. Then, while running a certain game or app, you press the Windows and G keys on your keyboard which will cause the game bar to pop up. If it's the first time you're recording a particular game or app, you'll be prompted with a message asking, do you want to open game bar, to which you will reply by clicking on yes, this is a game. To start capture, you simply press the record button or the win plus alt plus r buttons on your keyboard. To stop recording, you can press that same hockey combination or you can simply exit the game or app you were using and the recording will automatically end. By default, your video will be stored as a mp4 file in the capture folder located in your user videos folder. You can also find them in the video DVR section of Xbox where you are able to share, trim and rename the clip, open its folder location or delete it. Besides normal recording, you can also take a screenshot or set a background recording process. So you're probably asking yourself, what's there to might like? This is great, and it is, but it does have a few downsides as well. First off, if recording apps, you can only record activity in one app at a time. As soon as you exit or minimize the app, the screen capture will end. Unfortunately, not all windows can be recorded. For example, the Windows File Explorer. If you're thinking about recording your desktop, you can forget about it because it's not going to happen. Also, the app doesn't capture your mouse pointer, which is probably a deal breaker for tutorial creators like myself. This tool is basically made for recording PC gameplay. While I have heard reviewers saying that they had trouble recording games in full screen, there are plenty of videos in the community section of the Xbox app that prove it works like a charm. From my own experience, I found that even in windowed mode, the recorder will sometimes crash, ending the recording after one second. Let's take a quick look at some of the settings. You can access them by opening your Xbox app, going down to the settings button, and then opening the game DVR section. Here you can enable or disable the recording option. By default, it will be enabled. Below, you can set your keyboard shortcuts, set the maximum length of a video, set the output location, as well as the video encoding and audio quality options. In conclusion, I gotta say that the screen recording tool in Windows 10 is definitely a cool feature that the average user will probably find handy sooner or later. From a gamer point of view, while it can be useful while recording some casual gameplay, the lack of settings can't put it ahead of programs like Fraps, DxStory, or even OBS. For people who wish to record tutorials and software reviews, this one just won't do. While the tool can't be called bad, not being able to record the desktop and mouse cursor are two cons that can't be overlooked. So that would be all for this video. If you use the Windows 10 screen recording tool, please let me know what you thought about it. If you found this video helpful or simply enjoyed watching it, be sure to hit that like button, share the video with your friends, and be sure to subscribe for more similar content in the future. Thanks for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the next one.